notes. So F7, there's a pop-up showing an issue error message. Hi guys, in today's video, I'm going to show with you how to fix the issue related to the proofing tools in the Microsoft Office when you typing something in a Word document or Excel or any Office product you have the tool to validate the grammar and that's to name proofing tools and the shortcut for the tool is F7 so whenever you press the F7 you're gonna active enable the proofing tools and it's gonna check the grammar for you and I have a Word document right here and after I use the F7, there's a pop-up showing an issue error message cannot find proofing tools for English United States. So basically, this tool is not working for my office. When I click OK, it says Microsoft Office Word. The spelling checks is complete. And when I click OK, nothing happened. So basically, if the tool is working, it has the underlying red highlight for any words that have the grammar issue but basically the proofing tool is not working that's why nothing happened here and I'm gonna show with you guys one of the method to fix it today so what we're gonna do is we're gonna reinstall the proofing tools have the add-on tools for office you're gonna open up the run windows and type in appwiz.cpl and click enter so this is a shortcut to open up the programs and feature and you're gonna scroll down to select the office version install on the computer I'm using the office 2007 which is pretty outdated but I think you can apply the same way for other version of the office as well another way you can open up the programs and feature windows instead of using the shortcut that I just shared with you guys you can select the window on the keyboard and then from here you can type in program and select add or remove programs and you can open up the same windows when you are here select the office that have on the computer and then select change and the change or installation of the Microsoft Office show up you select repair and select continue next step showing repairing office enterprise it's gonna take a little bit if there's a windows showing like Microsoft Office Word document is in use you can close the document and continue close this and then go back select retry another way you can open up the add or remove feature windows is you can open it from the folder of the office version that you are using for example this is the office DVD that I bought come together with the key so when I open up this DVD, it's going to show up the Office Enterprise Add or Remove Feature windows as well. So I'm going to select Add or Remove Features and select Continue. Next step, I select the Share feature. Select into the plus icon to open up the submenu and scroll down a little bit. You can see the proofing tools here. X icon means that it's not installed on my computer. So I select the drop down and select run all from my computer and then continue the next window is configuration progress basically it gonna install that proofing tools and then eventually fix the issue related to the grammar checking so now the proofing tool has been installed completed into my computer I can close this setup windows and now when I open up Microsoft Word document I can click F7 and then the spelling and grammar windows gonna show up and I can check the grammar. So that is a quick tip how you can fix the proofing tools issue related to the Microsoft Office products. I'm using the version pretty old 2007 but I think you can apply the same fix by change or installation of the Office products that you are using add or remove features and then select the share feature and adding the proofing tools and now every time you press the F7 you're gonna have the spelling and grammar feature to check the wordings I hope this tip gonna helping you in fixing this issue related to the proofing tools 
If you have more ideas or any questions related to this fix, please let a comment below. Thank you for the watching. Bye. Nếu các bạn thấy hay, các bạn hãy nhấn nút like, thích và subscribe, đăng ký để ủng hộ Easy Tech Class nha. Cảm ơn các bạn nhiều. Thank you.